Hi, ladies. Final video, promise. This one is all my Valentine's Day goodies. So, let's see here. Let's get this bad boy up here. So, all this stuff, I ordered like four things from my hauls. I separated them. But all this stuff pretty much came from Dollar Tree, Dollar General, Walmart. All 99 cents, pretty much. So, yeah. I'm going to make a lot of noise for a second here. I guess I should have got it out before I started. I have it all in a box. So, of course, I got a couple of these. From the Dollar Tree. I'm only in two Valentine's Day swaps. There hasn't been as many as I thought there would be. I don't know. I see everybody starting to do Valentine's Day projects, but I haven't seen very many swaps. I got some bags. These ones are like the paper bags. Super cute. And then I saw a cute llama one and a cute unicorn one. But I had nothing to do for uh, Unicorn, and the Llama one was kind of messed up. It was cute, but the glitter was, like, smeared everywhere, so. All these bags came from Dollar Tree. And then I got some of the tissue paper from Walmart for 98 cents. And then, I like to use pencils for my wands instead of the straws, because I know a lot of times the straws bend. So, I got some pencils. Then, I showed this in another haul. I just pulled it out really quick. Yes, baby. This one's in my Alright, sorry about that. Five-year-old thinks he's starving to death. <laughs> So we got this going on right here. They're supposedly ta table scatter, but they're just glitter foam, double sided. Dollar Tree. Got these at Walmart, the little picks. I've seen some other people haul these. I do have something in here that I have not seen anybody haul, and I'm super excited about it. So, you know, the like the candy hearts right here. I grabbed two of the sequin mixes from Dollar Tree. Um, I'll show you guys the washi tape from Dollar General. I've seen a couple of people show this. Didn't have any Valentine's Day washi tape, so that works perfect. Um, from Dollar General, I also got the heart bling. And we got some stickers. I got the llama, love you, a llama treat sacks and the flamingo one. Then I got this at Walmart. I figured I could attach it to an end of a wand or something. I don't know. We've got these stickers and then these ones. Also, go and went ahead and grabbed these from Dollar Tree. Got two sets of this. I got the multicolored hearts, and then these ones have the the holes in them. I got the doilies in red, white, and pink. All that was from Dollar Tree too. Now, at Dollar General, they had four of these. They had two that were unicorn and two that were, I don't even know what he was. But I got the unicorn ones. They are make your own pinatas. Are these not stinking cute or what? So in the back, it's got the cardboard already scored and everything. And then the paper. And it's got the instructions. We can go ahead and open one and check it out really quick. So you can make your own unicorn Valentine's Day pinata. 
I thought that was super cute. If they would have had more, I would have bought them. But like I said, the other guy, he was kind of ugly. So, here's the boxes, the shape. And then it tells you rear, back, main, belly, back foot to put it all together. Here's some stickers to decorate his face. And then here is your... Um, fringe to decorate them with it is paper so you gotta be careful with it so super cool I'm gonna make a couple pinatas and fill them and send them to people haven't seen anybody haul that so I was excited and then from scrapbook.com I found these I ordered this with my last haul when I got the Alice in Wonderland stuff I didn't even know it was in there. It was under another sheet and I didn't look. But I got this more for the to match the boho. It's Wild Love is what this collection is called from Photoplay, but I got it to match the boho vibes. And when I ordered it, I honestly don't even know if I remembered that it was Valentine's. But that'll work. And then I went ahead and I got some of the heart paper clips. And then I got two things from Pebbles. I just got some stickers. And I went ahead and got the Pebbles, um, one of the ephemera kits. And I don't feel like opening it. I'll just show you the back really quick. So I got that. And then I'll show you guys my paper. I don't have any full collections of paper. But I got enough stuff to go through this first one, I believe. This first Valentine's Day hoopla because when I first started doing all this a lady was selling a whole bunch of stuff and I bought it from her so I got a couple of sheets of these browns and pinks and then on the other side it looks like this This glittery stripe and it's got red polka dots on the back. <coughs> Excuse me. Those are cardstock. This is single sided. There's two sheets of this and it's just really thin paper. Um, as you can tell, some of this is a little dated. You can tell just by looking at it. It's a little bit older style. But I think to, to start out with, this is fine. Some of them have dates on them. Let's see what the back looks like. I have quite a few sheets of those. I have multiples of them. I'm just leaving them together while I show you. This is super thick. Right here. There's two sheets of this. And it is extremely thick. One sided. Got some of this. Just went and pulled all my pink stuff. and See, like, this is pink, but if I turn it over and you see the color combination here, you can totally tell that this paper this is from 2008. So, and I found some of this paper that I bought from this lady from, like, 1994 in here. So, some of it I probably won't use. But, that's okay. A shimmery glittery flower sheet Let's see this one's from 2007 here's some hearts these are single-sided they're on the thinner side Red, pink some pink stripes hearts like I said these are all kind of basic but they'll work they probably all came from a collection I think she just kind of took them apart. I don't know. Because there's nothing on the back that would show that they were bought um, for single sheets. Bright fuchsia. This one I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I got eight. Sorry. Eight pages of this. Love XOXO hearts. It's from Pebbles Ink, it says. 
So this was, it's a little bit older obviously because it's got a, like their old logo on it. All these are single-sided that I'm not flipping over. this one and it's thicker cardstock also from the pebbles this is uh white on the back but it's kind of like ir iridescent yeah. i got two of these with lips and they do have um this on the back i got a couple sheets of blue that say love on it and they've got that design on the back so we've got this one this pink some more stripes two of these and it's just solid on the back and then like that blue one I showed you there's one in pink And then these are just some thicker card stocks. Move this out of the way. So see, I got quite a bit of paper. I'm good. This is a card stock one. This is like cowboyish, cowgirlish, whatever you want to see. Look into me. Some things I pulled some solid card stocks from my stash. I've got a ton. So I got three different shades of red and pink here, darker colors. So I got like that one, this brighter one, a red, and then that shade of red, and some whites. And then I went ahead and grabbed some glitter paper that I had. I got a white glitter, this purple glitter, and then this pack of two pink glitter. And then I have this pink. It's a little bit different. I don't know if I'll use this or not. The silver. And the gold I've already gotten into. And then I have a piece of acetate here. And then I have two packs. One's open and one's not of vellum. So that's what I got for my Valentine's Day stash. Slash haul. And I'm excited. I see everybody's already doing all their fun stuff for Valentine's Day. So I need to get rocking and rolling on it. Thank you guys for hanging out and watching my videos. I'll post some swaps and some project shares here shortly in the next week or so. And I hope you guys have an awesome day. Bye, guys.